Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. It's me, Dr. V. Jayakumar. I am making lecture videos for the benefit of mechanical engineering students. If you are visiting this channel first time and not yet subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell icon so that to get notified all my forthcoming videos. In this difference between series, we shall discuss the key differences between flywheel and governor. In a mechanical system, speed fluctuations are of two types. One is internal speed fluctuations. In other words, fluctuations within a cycle. That's where flywheel comes into picture. In the other type, we have speed fluctuations due to change in load on the system, which happens over a period of your time. That's where governors are used. We will be discussing those two terms very elaborately going forward. Let us get started with flywheel first. We know that flywheels are used in machines in which there is a fluctuation either in the input power or output power. In case of IC engine, input power will be fluctuating. Whereas in punching presses, the output power required will be fluctuating. Those scenarios would require flywheels. Flywheels a mechanical reservoir for storing mechanical energy. As discussed, flywheels are predominantly used in IC engines punching machines, presses, shear machines, rolling mills, etc. We can very well understand the function of a flywheel by using a turning moment diagram for an engine. In an IC engine, only during power stroke, we obtain power. Flywheel stores that excess energy during power stroke and supplies the stored energy during other three strokes. This all four stroke consist of a cycle. So flywheel reduces the speed fluctuations caused by change in turning moment during a cycle. It does not maintain constant speed. Here we have to understand that the cycle time is very, very short. It's a matter of fraction of seconds. So at the end of each cycle, energy stored by the flywheel will become zero and hence flywheel works continuously from cycle to cycle. Now we shall see how a governor functions. Governor is an automatic speed control device. It is also known as mechanical feedback device. Flywheel is used to reduce the fluctuation of the speed within a cycle. Whereas governor is used to maintain constant speed whenever there are variations in load. The diagram shows a typical arrangement of a mechanical centrifugal governor. Governors are employed in various applications for various purposes. Predominantly, they are used in steam turbines, in steam power plant, in diesel engines, in diesel generators. In automobiles, governors are used for two purposes. One is to limit the rotational speed of IC engine. Another one is to limit the speed of the vehicle. In fact, all these recent cars, BMW, Audi, Mercedes, all have speed limiters that protect the engines from damage due to excessive rotational speed. Let us consider a steam turbine driving an AC generator in a steam power plant as an example to understand the working of a governor. In practice, demand on the generator, which is nothing but a load, will vary from time to time. When load on the engine increases, obviously the speed of the engine will decrease. But we are required to maintain the constant speed of the engine. Governor will have a suitable mechanism which will increase the steam supply to maintain the constant speed. If load on the engine is decreased, speed of the engine will be increasing. In that case, governor will decrease the steam supply by using suitable mechanism. 
and the ends governor maintains the constant speed of the engine by regulating controlling the fuel supply as per the load requirements governor works intermittently that means it works only when there is a change in the load and hence there is a change in the engine speed so governor comes into picture in order to maintain the constant speed of the engine finally let us summarize the key differences between flywheel and governor so flywheel is used to reduce speed fluctuations during a cycle whereas governor maintains a constant speed of the machine system the operation of the flywheel is continuous from cycle to cycle whereas governor works intermittently in fact speed control is happening within a single cycle in case of flywheel whereas governor it happens over a period of time flywheel does not control fuel supply does not control working medium whereas governor controls the fuel supply flywheel is a mechanical device whereas governors are available in many forms mechanical pneumatic hydraulic even electronic flywheels are used in ic engines and fabricating machines such as punching machines presses shearing machines rolling mills etc whereas governors are used in steam turbines of steam power plant diesel engines of diesel generators and in automobile engines hope you have understood the difference between them to make this explainer video it takes a lot of time so please do support the work by liking the video sharing it to your friends and subscribing the channel thanks for watching see you take care bye